Hi, I'm Dana Probert, Technical Marketing Manager for Infrastructure, and I'd like to introduce you to Autodesk BIM 360, the next generation of BIM. So in our previous two videos, we talked about getting the add-in installed, we talked about setting up your account and pushing your model to the cloud. Now let's have a look at how we can share and collaborate while working with the model. So I have a model created. I've added it to my account for Autodesk 360 Infrastructure Modeler. And now the you know initial base data is in there. So let me go ahead and create an, um, a proposal for one alternative for this apartment complex. So I'm going to eliminate a few buildings, you know, throw in a little bit of water, add a little bit of, uh, of a green space. And I want to share this alternative with my team so that I can get some feedback. So my model is already in the cloud. All I need to do is synchronize it when I'm ready. So let me just change this road to be, have a bit of a boulevard, you know, just make it a little bit different so that I can throw it out there and have my team have a look so we can evaluate the feasibility of, of this alternative. So I'm going to synchronize my model back with the cloud information and my colleague Linda can then log into her account, pull down this information and get her model up to date. Looking over on my teammate's machine, she logs into her account. It's going to bring her up to our team group she can see the information that I've added with my proposal for the complex alternative one for the apartment complex. She then can create her own ideas which she'll then synchronize with the model and I'll be able to review them. So let's see what she has in mind. Go back to the master and adding a new proposal complex layout to just some ad additional ideas, another alternative. And here she can add data that she wants us to evaluate or to consider. You know, more ideas to work through, more alternatives for generating comments on, on feasibility, on concepts, on what we might like to accomplish as a team. So she synchronizes that model. And then I can then synchronize my model and see what her ideas were. So back over on my machine, after I've synchronized my model, with Linda's changes, I can see her alternative and my alternative right side by side and come up with some additional ideas, work through more alternatives and continue collaborating and evaluating these concepts um, against our, our project constraints. I hope you can see how the conceptual design and feasibility evaluation tools as part of Autodesk BIM 360 can enable you to publish, store and manage large models in the cloud. You and your team members can access, download, and edit shared models and scenarios simultaneously, review multiple project proposals using the same data more securely without sending large files via email or external hard drives. To learn more about Autodesk BIM 360, please visit our website www.autodesk.com BIM 360 or find us on Facebook. Thanks a lot.